So, welcome back. And today I'm going to be looking at something I built sort of for lols. Here it is, a fun build. It's, it's not even anything. It's called the Space Penny Farthing, and it features a number of little things here. So, basically, starting off with the uh, Plex Door kickstand. Oh, sorry, I just think this too hilarious. <laughs> it's obviously styled after the Penny Farthing. It has a rather, rather large rocket engine bolted on the back in a comical fashion. Uh, also, for defense, it has got a full battery of eight AMC groups running along the big wheel, and obviously we've got our turret on the back, uh, just sort of, you know. So, uh, just where case. did you get the inspiration for this? Um, I wrote it down on my list of I, I wrote it down on my list of ideas about uh, just before Christmas, and I just never got around to actually building one. Um, today, I just sort of thought, yeah, do you know what? It's time. Also, the Kickstarter has been made with as a gravity sort of ladder. So, so the ladder there, um, yeah, when you're in gravity, it's made so you can jump up that. So the only reason it's got a stand is because they made it to land on a planet. You know, do some exploring. <laughs> it is pretty cool. One of my favourite little features on it is I've tried really hard to make a sort of bike style um, cockpit, if you will. There's a, yeah. there's an actual seat. There's sort of pedals, I guess you could call them. Uh, the console's sort of handlebar style, and it's got a, a kind of like a moped style visor windscreen thing. <laughs> if not for the gun battery and the rocket, it would look like a penny farthing. Oh, believe me, before I decided to sort of combat ready it, it actually looked just like a penny farthing. Yeah, um, I can imagine. And I might actually make a slimmed down version of this without the guns on it, just for a, you know, just for a model. But I thought, if it's going to be a spaceship, it's got to have some guns on it somewhere. And then I went, just went a bit nuts with it. <laughs> it shows. But yeah, it's pretty cool here. I'm just going to show you this without the uh, kickstand up, and uh, it looks a bit better now. Because it's not going to fall over. <laughs> it looks pretty good, I'm going to be honest. I mean, especially I mean, if... If you it's remove, silly, but it, it is silly. Great. I made it as a, it's a fun build, you know. I've made a couple of yeah. sort of fun builds over the months and, and weeks. And, I think. Uh, eh, I've never really done many just random fun builds. Oh, you should. I mean, there was <laughs> there was the fail treatment, but let's not go into that. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, we better keep it friendly. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, I just wanted to show you that. Um, there's not really much to show, because like I say, it's it's a ship that looks like a penny farthing with a big rocket and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. But there you go. I may as well just fly it around. Oh, uh, pulsator spokes. That's quite cool. But anyway, let me just... Uh, here we go. It's like something they built on Jackass in the year 2375. Yeah, I wanted it to be a bit of a wacky racer-style sort of contraption. Hello, I'm Captain Picard, and this is Jackass. <laughs> so I've also got that's why I've got my camera just on top of the seat there. Make it so. <laughs> it actually looks pretty tough from some angles. <laughs> I just watched a bicycle fly away and do a barrel roll. I've never seen that before. Today Coming was back. a good day. I just thought it, it came out okay in the end. It's just the turret does kind of make it lose its uh, its shape, and the Dear guns diary. the guns clean it as well. And make it a bit noisy. Dear diary. The day I watched a penny filing bicycle fly away into the abyss and do a barrel roll. The day was a good day. All this and more on Mushroom Fleet. Wow. That was one of your stranger videos. So there it is. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time with more crazy ships and more. Thanks again.